the RMC Paladins continue their road trip to begin the second half of the season. The second weekend of the second half saw RMC take on the Western Mustangs and the Guelph Griffins. RMC has not played Western in Western in four seasons, have not played the Griffins in Guelph in five seasons. RMC looked to topple a giant that is the Western Mustangs, an OUA powerhouse. The last time RMC defeated Western was five seasons ago, where they came into the game 0-13 and pulled it out in a shootout. No turnovers at the blue line. Chip it in, go get it, dump it in, go get it. Their goalie's good at playing the puck, so we gotta press them, okay, and take the boards away. High percentage, simple. When we play simple and we get momentum, then we feel good about ourselves. Okay? All about your first shift. Not about what the end. Okay? One 30 second shift at a time to get off the end of the game. The longer we do that, the better we are, and then we'll be around to get the job done. That's how we get it. Woo! The Mustangs came out of the gate very fast, scoring a short-handed goal to open the scoring. They would add the lead to get it to 4-0 from RMC defensive turnovers and on a power play goal. But before the period was over, Scott Dominic will get the puck to the point to Alex Pim, who would fire a shot that Cal Phillips would tip into the net, and the Western had a lead of 4-1 after the first period. We were as good as them that period. We gave them gifts, and when you're struggling and they're a good team, they score on their gifts, we didn't score. Okay? So, no one gets to hang the lift. We are in the position we're in. Chip and go, they're not skating. They've taken penalties every time we've skated. Three power plays in the first, we haven't done that all year. Because you find a positive, the next guy finds a positive, all of a sudden now we have lots of positives. And that's how we change it, all right? So, have faith and faith will be given, okay? So we gotta make sure now. It's gonna take a little bit till we see the through, but you gotta go out there together, that's all. Play together, we'll get more power plays, we'll gotta get it, rip it. If they wanna block it, let them pay the price. And then let's go to the net, all right? Let's turn around. The second period was a game where defensive hockey coaches would have a headache after all the goal scoring. The Mustangs would extend the lead to 5-1, before Chris Merrick would tip in an Eric Lewis high shot past Greg Dobbs to get it to 5-2. The Mustangs had a six goal to look threat to blow the game open. But RMC is known around the CIS as the hardest working team in the league who show no quit no matter what the score is, and Alex Pim would make it 6-3 on a bang in, and then Eric Louis size would add to his goal scoring totals to get it to 6-4. RMC would not score again, and Western would add three more to take the game 9 to 4.
The next afternoon, the Paladins would travel to Guelph to take on the Griffins. In a game where the team would probably want back, they were down 7 0 after the first, 8 0 after two, and dropped 11 1 to the Griffins. take on the Army Black Knights in the Challenge Cup, and of course, the Car Harris Cup at the K-Rock Center.